going to demonstrate luring with my dog. It's really an important thing for my dog to understand. It's also a really important thing that you as a handler understand how to do. Um, I need to, I want to make sure my dog is kind of glued to my hands as I'm luring. Uh, notice I've got Wick on a leash. Keep your dog on a leash, a long line, whatever, because if my dog loses interest, I want to be able to just kind of step on it and say, no, don't take off into the living room. We're not working. I still want to maintain some sort of control of my dog. So I want to keep a leash on. I've got a treat in each hand. This keeps the movement really fluid for my dog. Um, there's less chance if I'm kind of switching from one hand to the other, it removes the chance or lessens the chance of me dropping the treat on the floor. Um, it's gonna start, I'm gonna, on my dog's face, bring them, I'm gonna reward them. At the beginning, if your dog is new to this, reward them fairly quickly, or they're gonna start to think, well, there's no point in me following because I don't get the treat. So I wanna reward my dog fairly quickly. I can bring her this way, bring her back around, add her to the other hand, bring her over, reward her. As she gets better, I can ask her to go farther and farther because she's gonna understand if I keep following, I will get that treat. So again, short ones initially, give her the treat. I have a pocket full of treats, so I'm not gonna run out. I'm gonna keep her engaged in this. She's gonna have lots of fun in this. I can bring her around to start to introduce her to different positions. I'm not calling them anything. I'm not naming them anything. I'm just showing her where they are and how to get in. Bring her up. I can put her in heel. I can even lure her into her sit. I can teach her to come to the front into a nice sit. As she gets better and better, I can bring her around. I can bring her all the way around the back of me. Once she understands to follow, she can come all the way around. I can bring her through my legs. All these things where my dog's gonna be completely comfortable. No issues down the road. Going all over the place. Good girl. I can practice luring into a down. I don't call it anything. I just lure her to the ground. But when I go to teach her her down, She's gonna have no problem understanding what I want her to do, because that's what we do, we just lure down. Lure her over. So work on luring. It's a fun, engaging thing for your dog to do. And they're learning lots. They're learning to follow you, you're fun. There's rewards, I get things for following and I understand what I'm supposed to do. We're gonna use luring in so many different things in training that if your dog has a really good understanding of it, you're gonna have a way easier time, all right? So have fun with the luring, be creative. Remember, don't let them get frustrated. Good, you're gonna end up super goobery. That's okay, that's part of the fun of it.